Talk 365's Small Talk is made possible by University Credit Union. We are here at the Bagel Project with Rob. Rob, thank you so much for talking to us today. Thank you. So I have to tell you, I read your story online and I absolutely love it. Will you tell us how you made it from New York, you came to Utah, and you tried to give Utah the New York bagel? Yeah, absolutely. So six years ago, uh, my family moved out from New Jersey uh, to Salt Lake City due to a corporate relocation for my wife. Woke up our first morning after moving in, and we were on, on the hunt for a real bagel like we were used to growing up. That was an ongoing process for the next two years of living in Utah. Uh-huh. And my wife then at some point challenged me to make a bagel. I thought she was absolutely ludicrous, but... Um, I don't give up on, on challenges like that. So um, six months later and 400 pounds of flour later, um, I was handing out bagels to friends and to colleagues. People just wanted more. Uh-huh. So um, I found a commissary kitchen and we started selling at the farmer's market at, uh, at the downtown Salt Lake City farmer's market. And we were selling out every weekend for two years, two seasons we did it. Mm-hmm. I was receiving so many midweek orders that um, I decided to um, put pen to paper uh-huh. and figure out if a brick and mortar would actually be worth the time. Yeah. So the financial seemed to be making sense. I went to a traditional um, national bank to look for funding. They promised me a, a six week closure time okay. from the day that we started um, talking about funding. Believe it or not, it was three months later that we were at the signing table, and at the signing table, they had changed the terms of of the deal. Oh, wow. So I obviously walked away from the table. Uh The next day, I found the uh, University Credit Union, Mm -hmm. and from the moment that we engaged uh, in our first meetings, we just hit it off, and it was really became more of a partnership than a client-customer type of relationship. Um, The loan officer was extremely candid and transparent, and I was as well. Six weeks later, um, we closed the deal, and uh, we're now in our 10th month of our brick and mortar. Um, It's been an incredible experience. The uh, University Credit Union has really been uh, an amazing business partner. Um, They really understand the local um, economic landscape and how the small businesses really impact the local economy. It's been fantastic. Awesome. That's great to hear. I'll, yeah. I'll have to pass that on to yeah, the guys. Yeah. So tell me how you picked University Credit Union versus, I mean, obviously there are other credit unions. Um, to be honest with you, I was uh, a friend of mine in the industry as well had recommended um, the, the credit union. I have never worked with a credit union before. Mm-hmm. It was the only credit union that actually stuck out in my mind from just driving around town. So yeah. um, it was just a, a quick phone call. Yeah. I love the cus- the customer service and the personal care. I, they really are like the yeah. local yeah. Oh, and the love and the willingness to help you. It's pretty, it's like unbeatable basically. And that's yeah. for me like working with them on like trying to figure out an auto loan and right. then guiding me through it and like taking out a credit card. And I mean, they're just amazing. So, yeah. and that's like, not even solicited. That's just the, you know the they're the best. Really good too. They, it is pretty. It is pretty good. But Rob, I love your story. Um, I you. haven't tasted a bagel yet, but I am told that I can't really expect 100% it's a New York City bagel because there is certain ingredients that is absolutely unavailable here. Well, that's actually a fallacy. So oh yeah, it's a very good. I'm glad that you brought that oh, up. Oh good. Yeah. So before starting this business, I really did my homework. I did extensive market research. I went to New York City where. I lived for 12 years and visited all the shops that I used to um, eat bagels at, spent time with the owners, worked with the bakers, and it turns out that 90% of those bagel shops are adding preservatives and sugars to their dough. It really turns out that the water is not the key ingredient on a great day. Oh. Okay. Yeah. So that's just New York City myth. That's right. That's those that's New right. York. So forget about it. Forget you know, about it. That's you know, right. You don't need New York City water. That's right. That was a that's horrible right. accident. That's all right. That was that's terrible. Hard. But you don't. But you don't need it. You figured it out. You're not yeah. obviously going to tell us. Well, we. It's. There's a couple trade secrets, but we you use. We use two fermentation processes that create the the bagel for how it was intended to originally be made and and, and, and to taste. So. Um, those two fermentation processes um, are labor intensive. Um, it takes a long time for um, the maturity of the dough um, to get to where we want it to be. 
And um, as a result, a lot of companies find it a very inefficient and, and not a cost-effective way to produce these, sure. kind of, yeah, these, these products. So um, we adhere to old world, turn of the century, or I should say pre-turn of the century um, ingredients to make our, our, our bagels. So we will get an authentic You will, you bagel will. If right you, here. Yes, today we sold out, so yes. unfortunately I don't have anything for you, but oh, you come back right. and we'll hook you up. We'll you eat, you yeah. eat some of those bagels and we'll help you with that new organic stuff. There you I, go. Will it? Yes, it That's will. what I need to have yes. happen. Rob, thank you so much for yes, talking to us. Thank, thank you. you for spending thank some you time. I will definitely be back. I'm a huge fan. Great. And these guys are going to have a second location. Yeah. How awesome. I'm we didn't excited. even know that. Yeah. It's so much fun. Well, thank you so much for joining us, Todd. Thanks for coming. Thanks. I think we need yep. to do this again just because I want to go around and meet more business Let's owners. Let's do. We've that got was more fun. Day.